What's up, YouTube friends and family? I'm alone here once again. Today I'm going to be um, marking a knife. Uh, individual in, in my comments on one of my videos asked me about uh, marking knives, and I told the individual that yes, it, it can mark knives because it's it's made to mark metal. So, but today I want to you know to make a video to show how well. It can mark a knife and what I'm doing so far I'm doing a, a, a Chinese dragon um, with the lettering saying um, watch your fingers and basically I'm running everything as normal except I'm running instead of having my reverse on I'm just running it as a grayscale reason why I'm just running it as a grayscale because it takes that background square out like like last week sometime I did this uh, this uh, Yosemite Sam on this um, black dog tag and you see how you got the, the white square in the background well I did a, like a little test on this dragon on the other side of the knife this is an old knife and when I just ran it as, as a grayscale, it just it just engraved the dragon itself, not the little picture box or whatever you want to call it. So, without further ado, let's make sure we're in a good spot. Looks like we're in a good spot. And let's get the marker. As you can see, it's just just going to engrave the drag. And I should be pretty much good just engraving it one time. I turned my, contra my uh, contrast up to one because that's as high as you can go with the, um, the, the CCAD software. One is, one is the darkest. Should be good. And we're done. So let's see how it came out. So there you have it. There's the dragon. And I can get a better lighting. And watch your fingers.
So let me guys know what you think in the comments. And I hope you like this video. And thanks for watching. Oh, before I leave, I want to tell you guys I did a test. So this is the other side, and as you can see, when I had my reverse on, it kept that little box. And once I turned it in the grayscale, there you go. Once again, thank you guys for watching.